Hey guys, join me for part two of day one of our trip to Minnesota and Wisconsin for the 100 mile yard sale. Hi, it's Lori from Dakota Relics. Come join me as I travel around the area searching for treasures that I can buy and then flip for a profit. You'll never know what I find unless you follow me. Come on, let's get shopping. Oh, they're not real stained glass. This one holds a little more hope for me. Oh, look at that. Jack Daniels table. That's cool. It's like a saw blade. That's neat. $50. Satin chair covers. Yeah, they would be. <laughs> Look at it's even a glider, Kath. That's nice. I changed my sunscreen this season. Very nice. I'm not sure if I was reporting prior, but let's see. I think huh, a long, longer burger. Oh, but twenty dollars? Yeah, can't do that much. I should move that out of the sun for them. They're gonna melt. Mm -hmm. There's a snowman fisherman. It's kind of nice. And the table runner. Oh gosh. It literally just stopped on the side of the road. So, what is this? Copper mat manic. Oh, cop copper copperama. Incorporated. On a cast iron. A big boo boo. Yeah, isn't there? Yeah. Oh, that's quite the scale. That's my little thing. <laughs> the oldest thing? Okay, this is an Amish bake stand. Look at this. Cinnamon infused maple syrup. And I did have some of that. It was amazing. But it's $19 a bottle. But little sacks of cookies for $5. Homemade breads, which I am going to buy the cheesy garlic bread for our snack tonight. But so many other good things. Blueberry danishes. Honey cinnamon granola, blueberry crumb pie, pickles, honey, blueberry jam, triple berry jam, oh my gosh, English coffee, oh my gosh, I know that'd be so good. Pizza crisper. Wow. A radar wear. 
a man or radar room. Yeah. That's what we had. It was, is that like a mic? Yeah, a yes, microwave. It's a microwave. But it was uh, one of the early ones. Yeah. Look at all of these um, candy forms. Yeah. A lot of them. These are metal ones. So there's some crazy music playing in the background here, but the one thing you will find on the Wisconsin um, 100 mile yard sale is a lot of fishing stuff. Of course, they're right on the, the banks of the Mississippi River, and um, I just don't know anything about fishing lures and fishing equipment. This was kind of a fun spot. Um, this is a jewel key set that has um, a lot of serving pieces, $100 for it all. Not really interested in that. Don't really want to ship that. These wooden golf clubs, I probably should have picked up. There were two wooden golf clubs and then a, an older um, metal shaft. Uh, only 12 bucks, and I'm not sure why I didn't grab those. But, um, oh, this little lovely baby carriage also contained a picture of a child and um and his brother or sister pushing the carriage um as you can see we are literally right on the mississippi river here um one of my favorite things about this 100 mile yard sale is the scenery it's beautiful this, I thought, was carnival glass. Actually turned out to be metal. Um, price kind of high, so How didn't pick it up. How cute is this? The Gypsy Wagon Curiosity Shop. And there's Gypsy. Oh. Hi. How much is this the chandelier? One hundred and twenty-five. Cool. What is that guy doing out there? These are some fancy candles. You can adjust them how you want. To have them go. No. Oh, I see some skyscraper lamps. Old box camera. Those are some old lamps too. That's cool for $14.99. Hufflepuff. Hmm. Interesting things here. Oh, $69 for those. Skyscraper lamps, no thanks. Let's go next door, see what we can find over there. Oh. Well, this one isn't in the greatest condition though. I sold one of these. The dog? Yeah. 
It, it's worth a lot of money. Huh? It's worth a lot of money. Is it? Yeah. Made in Italy. These look like Staffordshire dogs to me, but they've made it. They've made them into bookends. Huh? I think they've made them into bookends. I, I, they're not supposed to be bookends, I don't think. So we stopped to get ice cream, but it's also an antique store, and I'll show you what I got in there. But in the back here, oh, and this ice cream is good. It's like a little grotto. Lots of statuaries. It's so pretty. Oh my gosh. Little pig. <laughs> and then look at that. The topiary circle with a statue in it, but then there's like a little magical castle. Oh. And then I bet that's a staircase to the upstairs apartment. Okay, look at this. It says antique poker box. I know it's not antique, but I'm going to look inside of it. I'm also going to look over here a little bit. Oh, look at those little tiny nut breads. Mm hmm. Okay. Back over to look at that. Oh, a few things here that might be vintage, so we're gonna look around. Uh, we're in Nelson. That's where we're at now. Lots of books. Number three. Good health, number three. Yeah, stuff that my daughter likes. Cute little candy dish. I was like, this is Northwoods. Yeah, they got it right. They have it right. It's pretty too, isn't it? Mm -hmm. it matches. Yeah. Get close, Sam. Should we buy this for Brenda? Oh, yeah. she needs a clock. Yeah. Remember, she said for the back of, back of her bathroom. Yeah, <laughs> Okay, this one is listed as a state sale. You cannot believe how many we've passed up. There are so many. I always like those little covered dishes. What's this? Oh, that's kind of cute. It's three dollars. Hmm. Oh, 
1984. Photos in there, I guess.
Okay. Oh.